like pit stop. Just gotta go and get some food. McDonald's. I finally made it. Now to start the fun. And so it begins. Two days, you messed up myth. Freshman orientation. Let's see how it goes. Let's get checked in. Whew, big numbers. All right. Second floor, I think. Seven thousand two hundred and sixty four. Seven six. Can we go all the way like there's even another hallway over there? Okay, thanks. Sounds like we gotta walk. Alright, well, looks like I'm here first, so I get to choose and I want this one. Because it's behind the door. So there we go. Woo! Dope. I've claimed that. Playing some weird games. I don't know what's going on. They're gonna tell us now. Let's see what's going on. So like, we'll say something, we'll be like, oh, get in groups of five. So you gotta get in groups of five. Oh. Whoever's left oh. out, loses when you get out, right? So it's really fun, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna play you know, so I can help them. Game is weird. I didn't like it. And it looks like we're climbing around the round. We're playing some duck duck goose over here at UMass Dartmouth. That's what we do. Who's he gonna choose? He's gonna try to choose a slow person, isn't he? Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna catch him. Yeah, he went all the way around. Yo, careful on the turn. Careful on the turn. Yep. We've been told we can't play because we're too rowdy. Still playing games. Hmm? Still playing games. Gotta start our information center in this. Further, I want you to know that I know that for some of you, this is no problem. Uh, every year, I talk to students. I talk to parents that love change. They embrace change. But I will let you know that most of us hate change. We're creatures of habit. We think in patterns, we act in patterns. Think about this, young people. How many of you last year, when you were a senior in high school, when you ate lunch in the cafeteria, how many of you had a table that you owned? Yeah. It was yours, and you sat there every day. Parents, you'll love this. How many of you, if you eat dinner with your sons and daughters at home, if you eat at the dining room table, how many of you have assigned seating at the dining room table? Okay, it's not really assigned, but how many of you know where you're supposed to sit? And by the way, if you wanna have fun after orientation, when you go home, the first meal at home, sit in your dad's chair. Let's go ahead and get started. Let me give you the very first one. Young people, starting today, your life is really a series of choices. And here's the change. Starting today, you get to make the choices. But good news, parents. Starting today, you have been officially promoted. You are now consultants. I'm in the cab, eating some food. Done with lunch. Jim is nice. There's basketball. I just finished making my schedule. Looks like I'm gonna be busy. Look at this. Your feet are squeaking. I can't stop this. And you must be willing to pay attention to that if you're gonna build an inclusive community because what I need may not be necessarily what you need, okay? And what I need may not be necessarily what you need. And so in order for us to build a community, 
where everyone feels like their needs are being met, we must pay attention to diversity. I know, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> this is a long yeah, day. A long day. I'm about to play a game show. Woo! And there's my team. They look incompetent. I'm joking. Ha. They're a bunch of weirdos. We'll start with you. We'll give you 20 seconds. Just tell us why you're the greatest candidate. That's all you gotta do. Alright, you ready? Your 20 seconds starts now. Hello everyone, my name is Alexa. Okay, here, I am an amazing candidate because my biggest dream in life is to buy 20,000 toasters and 40,000 pieces of toast. And I will make every single, oh, I'm sorry, 40,000 loaves of bread. And I will make 40,000 pieces of toast and buy a little bit of avocado and put, it, put a little bit of avocado on top of that and serve it all to you guys. Oh, you got it. That's always another tough one. Zero, 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 and 100. Snap, crackle, and pop. Our characters with cereal for number two. Rice Krispies. Yes, here we go. 100, 300, 300, 500. What is this audio clip? I got you. Oh, number three. Yes, that's number two. Grease. Grease. You got 100, 400, 500, and 700. Here we go. How many animals did Moses take on the ark? That's number two. Incorrect. Oh, that's number three. Three of each? Incorrect. Are there 50? It was Noah, right? Not Moses. He's choking. He's choking. Stop choking. Who wrote Green Eggs and Ham? Alright. 